Tumpa kunpa yiya moka paata. Watanai kachu. Ginging kuno ba muli rachi kun. Tung na punsha nyunyang. Kapa kunpa mulchi kamana. Ichuta! Yun pakisa! Inba ni chalora kun! What? What do you want? What? What do you want? I'm not doing anything wrong. I'm just standing here. Hey, I'm not looking for any trouble with the Sith, all right? Please, just let me be. Muli, Muli Batong, Pa Akat in Tutune, Kino Muli Rani Lubo, Tom King Ba, Loko Netsag, Da Hupa Da Tenya G. Jojo Piti, Chiwak at Aita Kang Kicha na Jupor Nibo, Kun Muli Ras Nimo Boy Wanga, Tony Tuama G. Human Act in Tikatune, Chiwi Aita Katong Chicha. Agi Inko Tune, Chuna Muli Ra, Tony Tuama G. Kona. What? What do you want? Hey, I'm not looking for any trouble with the Sith, all right? You Sith don't scare me. Down here the swoop gangs are in charge, and you don't have enough troops on Terrace to do anything about it. Sorry, but your kind aren't welcome in here. The hidden backs don't care much for you, Sith. The swoop gangs rule down here, not you. You may have conquered Upper Terrace, but you don't have enough troops to sweep the whole lower city. You come down here in force and we'll pick you off in hit and run battles and vanish like smoke into the back alleys and hidden tunnels where you'll never find us. Stick to the upper city where people are actually scared of you. Your threats don't count for much down here. Sorry, but your kind aren't welcome in here. The hidden backs don't care much for you, Seth. The swoop gangs rule down here, not you. You may have conquered you, stick. You guys are behind with your payments. What do you, uh, you think just because you're in some gang, you don't have to give Davik his cut? Kavatum <laughs> 
パムルチカマナロンガディホトンガクンハンガビワナクンベースチンパラムレトンキンバーノノタクトウクニンチャトコンデムレラベスあ,あ、so you want to play this the hard way <laughs> okay ドネポドラナノプラタドンノサルチャイチュアペンキワタナウアマムレラケンチュンジュパンシャクノワボレモレラジジョネトンドルジチウィイタドボラオナディチェクバラモレスリモワンガコンビスチン I knew you boys would see reason Now get out of here Too bad I was looking forward to cracking some heads Maybe next time Candrus I better get this over to Davik I'll call you if anyone else gets behind on their payments. Those Valkers are dumber than a chorus and granite slug. They actually think being in that pathetic little gang of theirs makes them important. Gadon keeps his hidden Bex in line, but Brezik's getting dreams of grandeur. If Davik's smart, he'll slap that young punk back down. I'm someone you don't want to get on the bad side of. And I'm not one for small talk. Besides, you know the arrangement. You Sith don't interfere with Davik's business, and you all get a nice cut of his action. I don't have time to stick around here anyway. Davik's got me working on a special assignment. You Sith don't scare me. Down here the swoop gangs are in ch- You Sith don't scare me. Yes, what's on your mind? I'm all ears, beautiful. Which, the fact that I'm all ears, or the beautiful? I might consider it, but what are you going to call me in exchange? I like the first part of that. I'm a bit more partial than the most handsome pilot in the galaxy. Well, what do you think? Well, then I guess gorgeous will just have to do until then. Well, then. No, but kidding aside, I bet you're not about to give up on those questions, of course. Are they really necessary? No, no, how can I resist a challenge to my manly pride, huh? <laughs> Fine. You made your point. Interrogate it well. I don't get testy. I get angry. And if I was angry, you wouldn't have to ask me if I was, let me assure you. Let me ask you something first, though. I've been going through the battle aboard the Endar Spire over and over in my head since we crashed. Some things just don't add up for me. Maybe you could tell me what happened, from your perspective.
true. Bastila is as powerful as they say. She's the one who defeated Darth Revan, after all. Mm. I guess that no Jedi ability, no matter how powerful, makes up for being completely surprised and outmatched. We didn't choose that battle anyway. It got forced on us. Hell, I'm, I'm, I'm just as surprised that any of us are alive to talk about it. Come to think of it, it's more than a little surprising that you happen to be here, isn't it? I mean, just what is your position with the Republic fleet anyway? Not at all. I just think it's a bit odd that someone who got added to the crew roster at the last minute just happens to be one of the survivors. You were the only one. Not to mention that Bastila's party was the one who requested your transfer. The Jedi requested numerous things when they came on board, but now they practically took over the ship, as far as I can tell. Considering your connection to Bastila and the Jedi, whether you know it or not, your presence here seems a little convenient. I'm probably wrong, and this is probably nothing I know. I learned a long time ago not to take things at face value, however, and I hate surprises. I expect you, right? I've got no real reason to suspect you of anything. Still, it's better to be safe than sorry, right? Look, it has nothing to do with you personally. I don't trust anyone. And I have no reasons. And no, I'm not going to discuss them, so can we just keep our mind on more important things? All right, all right. You must be the most damn persistent woman I've ever met. We'll talk about it, but later. Right now, I just want to get going. There's a bounty on your little green heads. I'm here to collect. That's the plan.
Hey, I'm not looking for any trouble with the Sith. Hey, I'm not looking for any trouble with the Sith. All right? Please, just let me be. Ready. What? I cannot render assistance, citizen. Move along. Arrest me, are you? I don't know. I don't want no trouble with you, sir. What? What do you want? You ain't gonna arrest me, are you? I don't know anything, I swear! You out on patrol? What? What do you want? What? What do you want? You ain't gonna... You out on patrol? 
Americans. I, I, I don't want I, I don't want no trouble with you, Sith. I'm just a janitor. I don't know nothing. I, I don't want no trouble. You out on patrol? Consider yourself lucky. We're stuck standing guard over this dump to try and prevent it. You, you out on patrol? Consider yourself lucky. We're stuck standing guard. Tumpa ku pelea muka bata. Jio ka ku tumpa ku pelea.
Ready. I'm here. I'm here.
The swoop race coming up will show those bulkers who's in charge here. When we win, half the people following. You need to get inside. The black bulkers are gunning down everyone they find on the streets. Hey, you can't just walk in here. This is the hidden back base. How do I know you're not a Vulcan spy sent to kill Gadon Thek? A lot of people want to go inside and speak to Gadon. He's a hero of the common folk. But the days of the Hidden Beck's open door policy are gone. Between the Sith Conquest and the Valkyr Gang War, Gadon has more enemies than he used to. We're being careful about who we let in now. Well, we do need all the help we can get. And you don't look like you're with the Vulcans or the Sith. Besides, it's not like you can do anything to harm Gadden in the heart of his own base. Not with Zedra watching his back. Go in and speak to Gadden if you want. Just remember to be on your best behavior. The Hidden Becks are watching you. Shan Om Nong, Wanga Kun Beast Kim Ba Mula Ra, Choni Yun Tun Gigi Ida Dwana, Kawa Vulpa Muji Gumana Rundi Hadonga Kuhunga Bi, Wana Kunes, Jink Palamul, Tong Kim Ba Nakongek, Tung Ting Tachun Kun Nek Muli Rabest. Manaman Atota Haki Jukrata Bola Shui Chongatong Chong no Bunka Mulera Kunkile Kunkile no Ba Watende Chokolo Ono no Ku Mulera Hold it right there. Who are you? And what is your business with Gadden? Calm down, Zerdra. Nobody's going to try anything here in the middle of our own base. It would be a suicide mission. You're too trusting, Gadden. Brezhik and his Valkyrs want you dead. Anyone we don't know is a potential threat, and it's my job to make sure you're safe. Do you want us to start attacking strangers on sight, Zerdra? Like the Valkyrs do? I will never let it come to that. Now step aside and let them pass. As you wish. You can speak to Gadden if you want, but I've got my eye on you. You try anything and you'll be vaporized before you can say Valkyr spy. You can speak to Gadden if... You'll have to forgive Zerdra. Ever since Brejic and the Vulkers began this war against us, she's been a little overzealous in her security duties. The problems with the Sith haven't helped things. Zerdra seems to forget that I know how to look after myself. Now, how can I help you? A foreign army invades Terrace, declares martial law, and locks down all travel to and from the planet? You damn well bet I have a problem with that. If the Sith ever moved in down here, all the swoop gangs would unite against them. We'd use hit-and-run guerrilla tactics to pick them off. Their casualties would be enormous. Don't fool yourself. The Sith would never commit to that kind of operation. They'd, they'd probably do something much more grand and deadly. But so far, the Sith have stayed out of the Lower City. And our strength is wasted on this stupid gang war. I tried to explain this to Brezhik, but he and his Vulcans won't listen. The escape pods? You know, I heard the Sith have been asking around the upper city about them as well. But you don't look like you're with the Sith. They might be spies, Gadden. They might be working for the Sith. Calm down, Zerdra. If the Sith thought we knew anything useful, they'd have a battalion of troops kicking down our door. No, I think this offworlder has her own agenda. 
I suppose I could tell you what I know. It's not like it could do any harm to me or my gang. But it might cause problems for the Vulcas, and that's okay in my book. The Vulcas stripped those pots clean within hours after they landed. It's too bad we didn't get there first, considering what my spies reported the Vulcas found. A female Republic officer named Bastila survived the crash. We Becks don't believe in intergalactic slavery, but the Vulcas aren't so picky. They took a prisoner. Normally, the Vulcas would take a captured slave and sell them for a nice profit to Davik, or an off-world slaver. But a Republic officer is no ordinary catch. I still think Bastila is just a Republic officer. That could work to our advantage. Maybe she'll even figure out a way to escape from the Vulcan base on her own. She's too valuable to leave with the Vulcan scum at the base. Brezhik's probably got your Republic friend hidden away somewhere safe until the big swoop race. your friend has become a pawn in Brezhik's game to take over the lower city. He's offered her up as the Vulcan's share of the prize in the annual Swoop Gang race. By putting up such a valuable prize, Brezhik hopes to win the loyalty of some of the smaller gangs. Their numbers will allow him to finally destroy me and my followers. So how do you propose we go about rescuing Bastila then? Well, we can't fight all the gangs. The only hope you have of rescuing Bastila is to somehow win the big season opener of the Swoop race. I might be able to help you with this, if you'd be willing to help us. We both have something to gain here, and much to lose. The swoop race is for the lower city gangs only. I could sponsor you as a rider for the Hidden Bex this year. If you win the race, you'll win your friend's freedom. But first, you have to do something for me. My mechanics have developed an accelerator for a swoop engine. A bike with the accelerator installed can beat any other swoop out there. But the Vulcars stole the prototype from us. They plan to use it to guarantee a victory in this year's swoop race. I need you to break into their base and steal it back. Getting into the Vulcar base won't be easy. The front doors are locked tight. But I know someone who might be able to get you in the back way. Mission Veil. Vale. Mission? Gaddon, you can't be serious. She's just a kid. How is she supposed to help them with this? Mission's explored every step of every back alley in the lower city. Plus, she knows the undercity sewers better than anyone. If anyone can get inside the Vulcar base, it's her. She and her Wookiee friend Zalbar are always looking to stir up a little excitement. They like to go exploring in the undercity, despite the dangers. Your best bet is to look for her in the undercity. But you'll need some way past the Sith guard post at the elevator. A simple disguise might have worked on the upper city guard, but the security down here is much tougher. You'll need the proper papers to get past him. Luckily, my gang ambushed one of the Sith patrols headed down to the undercity. They never made it, and their security papers fell into my hands. Since we're working together now, I suppose I could give them to you in exchange for your uniforms. With the security papers, you won't need a disguise anyway. I like to be prepared. Eventually, the Sith are going to try to drive us out of the Undercity. Sith disguises might give my people the edge we need in a crucial battle. Good choice. Thanks for the uniforms. You won't need them with these security papers anyway. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Your time would probably be better spent going after the prototype swoop engine the Vulcan stole from us. But I'll answer your questions if I can. Uh, very tactful. Are you itching for a fight or something? How dare you? I should kill you where you stand. Calm down, Zerdra. I'm not ashamed of what I've become. As you can see, I lost my eyes in a swoop racing crash. I rely on these artificial replacements to see now. But my blindness was not the worst consequence of my accident. My affliction was what eventually led to this war between my Bex and the Vulcars. When I lost my sight in the swoop bike accident, 
Everyone assumed I would step down as leader of the Hidden Becks and let Brezhik, my most trusted follower, take over. But with my ocular implants, I can still see well enough to lead this gang. And I knew Brezhik wasn't ready to take over yet. Unfortunately, Brezhik didn't agree with me. In a rage, he left to join our arch-rivals, the Black Vulcars. A lot of the younger gang members followed him, and soon he and his followers had taken control of the Vulcar gang. Brezhik is a proud man. My decision was a public humiliation for him. Maybe if I had stepped down, this gang war could have been avoided. Don't fool yourself, Gadden. Brezhik wants to control the Lower City gangs. If you'd stepped down, he'd have led the Bex against the Vulcars. He wanted this war, one way or another. <sighs> I know you're right, Zadra. Brezhik won't rest until I am dead and the Bex are no more. But it's hard to accept the truth of his betrayal. Your time would... She and her Wookiee friend Zalbar are always looking to stir up a little excitement. They like to go exploring in the Undercity. Your best bet is to look for her in the Undercity. But you'll need some way... Your... Not while the Sith Quarantine is in place. Even the fastest smuggler ships can't break the blockade of the fleet surrounding the planet without the proper launch codes. Any ship leaving the terrace atmosphere without the proper codes would be instantly disintegrated by blaster cannons fired by the Sith fleet's automated targeting systems. Your... When I lost my sight in the swoop bike accident, but with my inner... Your... I suggest you hurry. The swoop race is coming up, and we want you to have time to practice before the race. Uh-huh. On it. Damn! On it. What? 
On it. Damn! I'm here. Ready. On it. Damn! I'm here. And speak to Gadon if you want. Chiwi, I thought I
manaman atota haki jukrata bola shui chongatong chongkin no bunka mole ra kungkile kungkile no ba watende chokolo uno uno ku mole ra watana wa ma mole ra ke junju ba shak no wa bole mole ra ji joni tun durji chi wi ta do bola una dicek Pala mure slimo wanga kun bisching. Runda di hotonga kun honka bi. Wanda kun bisching pala mule tungking ba monotak. Tuk ninja tu kun de mule rabes. Greetings, stranger. My name is Gelrud. Are you a Pazak player by chance? It's so hard for me to find a match now that I've been banned from the Upper City Cantina. A simple misunderstanding. Some of the other Pazak players don't understand the finer points of the game. So what if I win 15 matches in a row? That doesn't mean I cheat. There's no justice. My lucky Pazak deck was confiscated and I was banned from the upper cantina. Since then I've been desperate to find a match. If you want to ask questions, go talk to Zax in the bounty office. He knows everything that's happening on Taurus. I'm just here to play Bazak. So do you want to play or not? Excellent. My funds were getting somewhat low.
You played well in our last match, but luck just wasn't with you. You want to play again? I'm sure you'll do better this time. Excellent. Played well in our lab. Excellent. You played well in our last. How dare you accuse me of cheating? It's not my fault you lost. I'm just a good player with a strong deck. Maybe you just need more practice. Or maybe you need to buy some better cards. Go talk to Uriah over there. He can sell you some cards to improve your deck, unless you want to play again right now. If you're ever looking for a match and you get tired of posturing in the upper cantina, just come down here and find me. I'll play you anytime. Three.
wait for the big swoop race. I hear Volkers have a new engine that's gonna break all the records. Huh? What? Oh, sorry. I didn't see you there. My attention was kind of focused on the Twi'lek dancers. Look at them waggle those head tails. Don't worry, honey. Alien girls aren't really my thing. I'm much more interested in an attractive female of my own species. My name's Holden, baby. Maybe you've heard of me. I work for Davik Gang, you know. I'm one of his top couriers. Davik's always sending me off planet to deliver and bring back packages. He knows he can trust me to follow my orders to the letter. Plus, I used to be an intergalactic customs agent, so I know all the tricks they use to catch smugglers. That gives me the edge I need on my courier runs. It's not like it's some big secret. It's kind of hard for Davik to keep a low profile when he belongs to a big intergalactic crime syndicate like the Exchange. Davik's ship is the fastest one in the entire quadrant. But even the Evanhawk can't get off Taurus until the quarantine is lifted. The Sith fleet has the planet surrounded. Any ship leaving orbit without proper access codes will be disintegrated by the Sith auto-targeting laser cannons. And those codes are locked safely away in the military base. Davik's pretty upset about it. His smuggling operation isn't making any money. But even with his underworld connections, he can't get his hands on those codes. Hate to see a pretty lady leaving. But you ain't the only girl in this place. I guess I'll go back to enjoying the dancers. Mucho shakapaka. Ye ki kun no ba muladra ki chichon. I can't wait for the big swoop race. I hear Volkers have a new engine that's gonna break all the records. Swoop race. No, swoop season is almost here. I hope I do better than last season. I lost a bundle betting on all the long shots. Ita patisa patua kacatutonga. 
pagrasya kong tiya ko umma. Chuba ka ha, chapa chawa chwish. Yun ko. Jodo jid bunga rantang. Takong jus tak miki grabul mo ko. Kachichu ita po tunga. Tolo bang wale o ganda naru chuchut. Pagrasya pong ka bola wala chikne. Mamule slimo puno da da na kubist. Mule rabes chi gratu no da pagrasya oni un kompa chin tumbo mo chuba. Lo da ni ta kun. Ita pati sa batua kacha tu tumbo. Pagrasya kung ti cha ko umma. Chuba ka ha chapa chawa chwish yun ko. Jodo jid bunga rantang. Tama do paco, palia muka pata, puta na chaco, e com cono pule marachico. Tung na bunga, nunca, cama volta multi cuta. Chancha pulara, umra o chisca duci, on chuba nisca yanki, ti toque gratun, um chicha com king, cacha chono pra, bogra. Nechi chuna chuba ching Lorda ita kona Shakji locha wana wama Kava volpa mulji gumana Chichun chichine chene kun Lopale mule raji kun Wana mong kuznes Chinga pula e mulan Tude rana prata Tunko Sunche doma doma Kava dumpa kapalia mona pata Bona na kachu Yin kin kun no ba mule ra chi kun Tong na bun sha nu yang Tin hun pa da pun da kit Ak ti kondo o na chaba chi sa wang ki Ti toki gran tu kon chi chan kun green kan chan tu pro Bok wala no bok cha Ni chi kon chu va kin lor da ita kun Kipuna, bona na kichu Kin pa mule ra dwana Tong kin ba no kudnok nek. Kava numpa kum pialia monokata. Ranga kun bis kin no monuat. Kakin chan na kwana po kon. Tangabun shan om nang. Wanga kun bis kin ba mula ra. Choni yun tun jiji ida dwana. Kava vulpa mulji gumana. Mitin em bon rang tong. Muli ra on shad foring um ni padoga wanga chon zi tse. Ika krotu haku jije, watu yama kama wuna henak nek. Mana, mana tota, haku ji krala bole ji chok, shun tang, shun kipa unna panka muli rikon kili, kun kili no ba, wati monya lakona una kun muli ra. Tinku ukaba, dopa no aska. Nisko na akawa ang baka. Mana mana tota hakuji krala bole ji chok shopping ko ukap. Kim kon shi kakchin awana wamata. Nishi la chorga kim kun pala mona rangei. Ching pala niska mule tun la tati kim po drunko. The search at Doma wana kunda tama. Randi i chawa tong bola Johnny ku. Yuma wama nibo lora waisha waga shi ching. Takum jus tak miki grabul moko. Kachichu ita bo dunga. Tolo bank wale o ganda naru chuchut. Mule shia punga bola wana ching ne. Mule slimo puta da da nanga kubist. Mule rabes. Runda di ho dunga kun hanga ma. Wana kun be. Is ching palamule tung king ba nuno tek tuk ning chetu kune mule rabes kencho pa chawi ti chok twist yun kun atu yama kama wuna henak nek bugra shak kun ti chiwa un chawa dong abuk shami no no bona na kachu kicha badwang wanga kum kiba bu mule rad kakin chak nawa gawa bakon. Tong ki ba nukunek, tong a bok sha um nak nong. Tak, bis tu 
Pongo Cookie Magpaka. Sin para chisca mule, tu narana, nu prata, tunco si cha, tuma, wamama, tus, que va toma. Nisha, yo lorcha, kinku no bule rajiko. Shagji kina, lorcha, watamwana, kinkun shishikin, ni kinkun ban mula rajikun, wamakun pes, chinkala mule, tune rana nu prata, donko searcha domatama, ni timen bon rank thong. Muli ra on shanturing um ni patoga wanga chonzi te. Ika krotu haku jije, watu yama kama wuna henak nek. Shanturing um ni patoga wanga chonzi te. Ika krotu haku jije, watu yama kama wuna henak nek. Lorcha Watamwana, Kin Kun Shishikin, Nikin Kun Ban Mula Rag Jikun, Wama Kun Bes, Ching Pala Mule, Tune Rana Nuprata, Donko Searcher Domatama? Mucha Hatunga Ya Fulke, Chachiska to Punta Casa Baka, Bana Oto. Moka Hotang Ya Foki, Chachiska to Punta Cacaspaca, Bana Oto. Takum Justak Miki, Grabel Moko. Kachichu ita bodunga, tolo bank wale oganda na lu chuchut. Nore sha ponga bola wana chipe. Amule slimo puta da na nga kubis mule rabes. Gigi hakuji locha kinku na da mule rigi kum. Kachichu tola podo to punta casa da bank. Ay ta hao danga o alaganto da naga tu chuchu muki ti chokay. Ti inti kita. Witi membo rang thong. Muli ra un shanturing um ni patoga wanga chon zi te. Ika krotu haku jije. Watu yama kama wuna henak nek.
juice chikata na patoga ya hulki kokora la jiji gahona botakwa i'll stick with the bounties david puts out they're usually less dangerous than the government funded contracts kio kaku kimba muli ra bona ji kuyami juuki chika nai kipona ona na kacho kimba muli ra bona Dirty work is something else. Wow. 
Wana Gomez Jimayakwele Tonera Nanyo Pwata Donko Tonera Nanyo Pwata Donko Sertia Doma Toma Tava Wipa Mwetje Tumana Kinkon Shashiken Neken Kone Wabwele Wadje Kwen Wana Gomez Jimaya Noeli Tonera Nano Pwata Donko Jiyo Kakon Molera Kinkon Jo Pesha Noma Molera Ji Jiyo Toran Ji Aita Pia Ula Una Jimek Bamulera Slimo Anga Kubis Jintava Pudo Tonera Nano Pwata Donko Sancha Nitro Atan Ji Rundi hau tonga tong Tunera nanu prata tungkyo Sertia toma toma Tala wipa mwetje kumana Kinkon shashike Neken kono ga mwile ga jekwen Wanda kumbes chintaya tuli Tunera nanu prata tungkyo Tawish manda wish Tungjone a hakono Mwilera yonunaze Jiichi mwibibwa na itawish Mwilime mwone Uba na tula boda Ya mijusa Ayo hono pis Tuwela jiyo kako Kala tumpa kulpi Yeya moka bata Jiska nicho Inkin kono babulere rajikom Tog na wong shanon yang Kawa wul babul jik kumana Rundi Kipo na Ona na kacho Kim babule ratwana Kawu babo tenya ko chocho pite Kawa dun baku bayi ya mokata Wanga kutis kimba mulera Kakin chana kok bakon Kawa dupa kubayi ya botenya Tunira manu prata tunjo Sertia doma toma Kawa wipa mwetje kumana Kinkon shashike Neken kono wa mulera jekwen Wanga kutis kimba ya mwili Tonera nano pwata dunko Rundi Tonera nano pwata dunko Sertia doma toma Kala wipa mwetje kumana Kinkon shashike Neken kono wa mwilera jekwen Kwana kumbes jintaya mwili Tonera nano pwata dunko Jibeb Laboda na wengi smatona Inkin slimo podo na mulera chikun Nova rundi hatunga kuhunkami Laboda na wengi smatona Inkin slimo podo na mulera chikun Nova rundi hatunga kuhunkami Tawish mana wish Tungjo ni ya hakono Mule ayo nunaze Jiji mwibibwa na itawish Mule mebohone Uba na tula boda Ya mijusa Ayo hono pis Tuwela jiyo kako Tumba toras matilia Hehe Asuta Wunga kumbis tolpe kiko yana Kipo na Ona na kacho Kimba mule ratu wana Tawu pabo tenya go chocho piti Tawa tumpa kulpa iya mokata Wanga kumbis kimba mulera 
Akin sa nangok ba ako? Kawa to pako tayo ya po tega Rundi haw kong natong kimag ng kongkeng Wag na kong bes, sinpa lang uy Kunung kabi Tuk ng tangjo, kunne muli rabes Kaki chonay na haw kong na Haw kong Diyos tak mike grabe moga Tulpada mong wayagang doda na ka chuchut Boga siyang pumpa, bayawa na chikni Bamul slimo po da nawanga kumbis Muli rabis Uy pada kong kwaya gando da nago chuchut Kawa na buta, awi at tagwa kang kidora Chilo mo rabi ni bobo Wanga kumbis kang bamuli ra Tong ay to ang jiji yumalit pa Agin ko tutong abog siya uminong Karawal pa mwesli Kumanabak muli ra Chuni yun tong jiji ay tatwana Karawal pa mwesli Kumana Tumpat Rundi haw tong natong kimbag ng kongkek Wang na kumbes, chimpa lamoy, kunung kabi Tuk ng tangjo, kunne muli rabes Labola na wengkis matona Hinkin slimo po do na muli rachikon Nola rundi haw tong natong kabi, chiyo kakol muli ra Kunjo pesha, no ba muli raji? Kero yon to raji ay tapia Kula una chinek, ba muli ras limo ang nakubistin Tumba Kaki chon ay tao dunga Tau kunjus tak mike grabe moga Tulpada mo kwaya gando da naga chuchut Moga siyang pumpa, bayawa na chikni Bamul slimo po da nawanga kumbis Muli rabes, labuda na wengkis matoma Hinkin slimo po do na muli rachikun Nova rundi hatong na kuhong kabi Tum Tumiran na nubrata tungkyo sa chato matoma Kawawin pa mwesi kumana Kinkon siya si Ken Ni Ken ko ino na mwile na si Ken Wanda kumbes chintala mwili Tumiran na nubrata tungkyo Tawis matawis Tungkyo niya hak ko no Kaya yun na si Chichi ni Biduan na itawis Muli na buwa ni Ula na tula roda Yan ni Jusa Ayo ho no bis Tuwil na si Yoka ko Si Biduan na ni Bobo Kung marun siya nun yan Muti dito aki Chichi haku Ako chiko pa Chibi This gang war is getting out of hand. The Volkers aren't just attacking the hidden Vex anymore. They go after everyone. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> 
How'd you like that? It's all one big city, but its golden years are long past. And things have gotten worse since the Sith occupied it. From what I hear, the wealthy live on the tops of all the tall towers, and if you're poor, you live down in the shadows. And it gets worse the lower you go. Well, that's all I can think of, at any rate. You got it. This gang war is getting out of hand. The Volkers aren't just attacking the hidden Bex anymore. They go after everyone. Oh, <laughs> 
You asked for this! Yes, what's in it? What do you got? Ready. Kipuna Kava Tumpa Kurpa Yiya Moka Paata Chiyoka Kutumpa Kurpa Yiya Kava Tumpa Kunpa Yiya Moka Paata Muli Rachi Kun, Tong Nabun Shanyunyang, Kavavol Pamulchi Kamana.
Gang wars getting out of hand. The Vulc I saw Devic's new starship at the space. Or before quarantine, they say it's the fastest ship. <laughs> 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 I'm here. Uh, I can't wait for the big swoop race. I hear Vulcans have a new engine that's gonna... Elevator is off limits. 
Only Sith patrol. It's obvious from the way you're dressed that you're not one of the Sith patrol. Well, why didn't you say so? Hmm. Everything seems to be in order. Okay, I guess you can go down to the lower city. Just be careful down there. Those swoop gangs will take a shot at anybody. Even our Sith patrols have come under fire. and speak to Gadon if you want. Assistance, citizen, move along. The 
area is off limits because of the riot after the last race. You Theresians couldn't handle it. Also, we're shutting down the swoop track. Just move I love this place. You can still smell the exhaust from the swoop bikes. I can't wait for the season to start up. You got any favorites in the season opening race this year? I don't know why teams keep letting riders come in with those experimental... Yes, what's on your mind? Terrace? Well, that's all I... You got it. This area is off limits because of the riot after the last race. You Theresians couldn't handle crowd control, so we're shutting down the swoop track. Just move along. Gotta sweep and clean, gotta have this place sparkly shiny for when the crowds show up. On it. It's open. What? Time oh. to rumble. I'm here. right there, or I'll give you a blaster shot right between the eyes. Now, what are you doing here? No, I'm the one with the blaster pointed at you. I get to ask the questions. What are you doing here? Well, go explore somewhere else. There's nothing interesting for you here. This is your only warning. If you bother me again, you won't walk out of here alive. Uh-huh.
Yes, what's on your mind? You do? Well, fair enough. What do you want to discuss? <sighs> I know you wouldn't understand where I was coming from. Let me try to explain. You're probably one of the most skilled women I've ever met. You've saved my butt more than once, and I'm lucky to have you here to help me. No question. But that doesn't mean that I'm gonna stop watching you being wary. I'm just not built that way. Period. You, uh, you haven't done anything yet. But there's no guarantee that you won't do anything in the future. I've been betrayed before by people, and I'm... I won't happen again. I don't know that you'll betray me, but there are no guarantees. Not for you, not for me. You don't have to take it personally. Well, you can stop wondering. I'm not. No, I don't want to talk about it. What I want is to save the galaxy, if that's even possible. Why is whether or not I trust you or anyone so damned important to you? What, why do you even care? We don't have time for this, so can we please just drop it for now? Can we pick it up later if you really must? I, mean, I want to get underway. A play! Ugly for the upper city. Yeah, go back to where you came from. We don't want your kind up here. Why do you care what happens to some scummy alien? He's just a freak. Yeah, he isn't even supposed to be in the upper city. Come on, let's go. I don't want to listen to this alien lover anymore.
remember. If you get your... Welcome back. It will just... Na praka donko tsercha chupa tanki. Ah, a chut. You again? Why do you keep bothering me? I can't help you there. Since this thing with Holden, I've been scared to leave my apartment. I don't know anything about what's going on in the outside world anymore. Just one of Darvik's men who can't keep his hands to himself. But all he got for his trouble was a nasty scar from my vibroblade. Too bad I'm the one still paying the price. I don't want to talk about it. I'm in enough trouble already. Besides, I don't know if I can trust you.
Okay, I'll tell you. J just try and stay calm. The last thing I need is trouble with you and Holden. Holden's a spiteful little hut slug. He went and put out a bounty on my head for what I did. That's why I'm hiding out here. I doubt it. Holden is one of Darvik's men. When you work for the local crime lord, the authorities tend to turn a blind eye. I'm afraid this is between me and Holden now. You could try, I guess. He usually hangs out at the cantina in the lower city. It probably won't do any good. Holden's used to getting his own way. That's one of the fringe benefits of being a goon for Darvik. Working for the local crime lord lets you get away with things. Still, I appreciate the offer. Goodbye and good luck. I hope you can talk some sense into Holden. didn't come to make it complain about the mess in the building. I keep asking for an assistant, but they expect me to do it all on my own. I'm Kadir. I'm, I'm the janitor here. Jeez, I know you're a new tenant, but I didn't think you'd forget me already. I have feelings, you know. Don't know how much I can tell you, but Seeing as how you're new here, I guess I could try and help you out. I should get back to you again. I'll probably see you around. I'm here most of the time. The building doesn't clean itself, you know. I wish the off-duty Sith would stop coming in here for drinks. I'm scouring the inner city looking for the Republic escape pods in the reek of the sewers. It's a good thing a few of the Sith come in here to relax when they're off-duty. I should keep them from closing this cantina down. Wow. 
Ladies and gentlemen, draw your eyes to the center ring. We have a very special presentation in store for you. As a legend of the sport, a 20-year veteran who still knows how to show the young kids a trick or two. Let's have a big hand for Mo. But there's always some young gun coming up to knock the veterans off. And we've got one of the best right here. I give you the mysterious stranger. Yes, what's on your mind? You got it. Yes, what's on your mind? Terrace? The planet's all one big city, but its golden years have long passed. And things have gotten worse since the Sith occupied it. From what I hear, the wealthy live on the tops of all the tall towers, well, that's all... Oh, you want to argue some more, is that it? What does it matter that much? Why can't you just leave it be? I just don't trust easily. And for good reasons to my own. Oh, damn it. I suppose I won't get any rest until I talk, will I? You want to know why I don't trust anyone? Fine. Here goes. Five years ago, the Jedi had just finished the war with the Mandalorians. Revan and Malak were heroes. I was damn proud of them. It was completely unexpected when they turned on us, invading the Republic while we were still weak. Nobody knew what to think. Least of all me. Our heroes had become brutal, conquering Sith. And we were all but helpless before. I mean, think about it, if you can't even trust the best of the Jedi, who can you trust? It's not that, it's... 
That's not what I mean. That there were there were others, good, solid, trusted men who joined them. Malik and Revan and the Sith deserve to die for what they've done. But the ones who fled the Republic and joined them are even worse. The dark side has nothing to do with why they joined with the Sith. They deserve no mercy. I know. I'm. And I should apologize to you. I've, I've become so accustomed to expecting the worst in others, and you've done nothing to deserve that. It's just. No, never mind. Let's just continue with what we were doing. Welcome to the Equipment Emporium. Finest selection of supplies in all of Terrace. You interested in seeing what I have in stock? Because of the Sith quarantine, I haven't been able to stock any new inventory, but I've still got some nice items you might be interested in. Show the young kids, but there's a...
Then you're going to learn the same lesson I taught Holden. I'm not as helpless as I look. My mama says I have to stay out of the lower city. That's where the bad people live. If any of those Republic space pods survived crash landing in the undersea. Taurus used to be a nice place before the Sith showed up and started bossing us around. walks among us. The enemy is here.
Hey, baby, back again, I see. I guess the old Holden charm is still working. The ladies just can't leave me alone. You're here about that? I guess Zax must have mentioned me to you at the bounty office. Fair enough. I don't care who takes her out. Just so long as the job gets done, I can't let her get away with what she did. That wench tried to cut me with her vibro blade. Because she's crazy. She started screaming that I was making advances, and the next thing I know she's coming at me with a knife. Yeah, right. Sounds to me like she was defending herself. And I admit I was drunk. Maybe I got a little fresh. But it was no big deal. She didn't have to cut me. Hey, you weren't there. She totally overreacted. I don't want to waste my time answering a bunch of questions. I'm here to have a few drinks, watch the dancing girls and enjoy myself. I've got to be mentally ready. Davik's got an assignment for me off-planet as soon as the quarantine ends. I'm one of his top couriers. Davik's always sending me off-planet to deliver and bring back packages. He knows he can trust me to follow my orders to the letter. Plus, I used to be an intergalactic customs agent, so I know all the tricks they use to catch smugglers. That gives me the edge I need on my courier runs. Davik's ship is the fastest one in the entire quadrant. But even the Ebonhawk can't get off Taurus until the quarantine is lifted. The Sith fleet has the planet surrounded. Any ship leaving orbit without proper access codes will be disintegrated by the Sith auto-targeting laser cannons. And those codes are locked safely away in the military base. Davik's pretty upset about it. His smuggling operation isn't making any money. But even with his underworld connections, he can't get his hands on those codes. It's not like it's some big secret. It's kind of hard for Davik to keep a low profile when he belongs to a big intergalactic crime syndicate like the Exchange. Hate to see a pretty lady leaving, but you ain't the only girl in this place. I guess I'll go back to enjoying the dancers. This better be important. I'm trying to watch the dancing girls. You got some news about Dia or something? Really? Huh. I guess that's it then. A real shame it had to come to this. She was a good-looking gal despite her temper. Ah well, plenty more ladies out there for me. If you want to collect the bounty, go talk to Zax. I gave him the credits for safekeeping. As far as I'm concerned, my part in this is over. Hate to see a pretty lady leave.
returned. You have the prototype swoop engine accelerator with you? Time is running out, you know. If you don't come up with that accelerator, you won't have a chance against the Vulcans in the swoop race. If you want to save this Bastila, then you better get that accelerator back from the Vulcans. Your time would probably... looking to stir up a little excitement. They like to go exploring in the Undercity, despite the dangers. Your best bet is to look for her in the Undercity. I suggest you... Anything moving down there, shoot first and ask questions later. <laughs> 